we come to scenes we'd like to see. So if everyone can make their way over to the performance area, I'll read out this week's topics, then we'll see what our panellists can come up with. OK, here we go. The first subject is... Unlikely small ads. Hello, my name's Ads. <laughs> For sale, one tent. Please contact the BBC. <laughs> Genuine single man looking for a relationship. Call this number. If my wife answers, hang up. <laughs> <laughs> Free to good home. Fucking printer. Phone to hear my talk about how I became obese. 888-8888. Rubbish collection services. Yep, we are genuinely shit at it. I saw you on the tube. You were wearing the pink sweater with your hair pulled back. I had my cock and balls out. <laughs> Do you want a hard-working plumber for a reasonable rate? Then you shouldn't have voted for Brexit. <laughs> <laughs> Learn English on Owner Home. Good examplings, quick books, disbelievable price. <laughs> you buy? <laughs> <laughs> Applications are now open for the Donald Trump School of Talking to Women because those bitches are not going to interrupt themselves. <laughs> Wanted the internet, as I seem to be the only person in the whole bloody world still using the small ads. <laughs> Have you lost a ginger cat? Check the top of Donald Trump's head. <laughs> Phone to hear my talk about my reaction to eating a South African bishop. Oh, 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 eight, two, two. <laughs> Respectable middle-aged lady would like to meet gentlemen for cosy nights in, country walks, theatre visits, and occasional eye-popping anal. <laughs> OK. The next topic is... Things you wouldn't hear on a TV cookery show. Hi, I'm Nigella Lawson, and before I bake any cake, I like to chop my flour into lines. <laughs> you can see that's rising nicely. It does that every time I think about how much money Channel 4 are going to pay me. <laughs> Hello and welcome to Can't Cook, Won't Cook. Today, we won't be making anything. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> Coming up next on Saturday Kitchen, whatever we want, because we know you're too hungover to change the channel. <laughs> this is a hot pot. This is a fucking hot pot! <laughs> So, if you want to bone a chicken, what you need to do, take it on a couple of dates and then... <laughs> invite it back, put on some romantic music and let nature take its course. <laughs> there, is, uh, there is a bit of a problem on this week's food and drink. I've, I've finished all of it. <laughs> <laughs> this is a uh, Thai chicken curry, or as I like to call it, hot Asian cock. <laughs> OK, Sam, let's see what you've brought in your bag of ingredients. It is a pint of wine and a large Malteser. <laughs> right, welcome to Southern Cooking for Northerners. First up, quinoa. What is it and why it can fuck off? <laughs> Well, if you're going to pop it in, don't forget to cover it first. I didn't, and that's why I'm making paternity payments. <laughs> Hello, I'm 
Greg Wallace, and this series of MasterChef, we won't be using plates. We'll just be eating off my shiny, shiny head. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, it's Nigella Lawson here again. I'm just going to say the word spatchcock for no reason. <laughs> spatchcock. <laughs> Anyone can make this. You can't, Beatrice. Sorry, you can't beat rice. Let's just go home. Let's just go home. Welcome. Welcome to Great Indian Bake Off. I'm Paul Bollywood. <laughs> Hello, I'm Jamie Oliver. Welcome to my new show, Stick a Bit of Fucking Sugar in It. <laughs> <laughs> OK. At the end of that round, the point's going to Mr Ian Josh.